Welcome back to Franz Crafts today. Uh, sorry it's been a while since I've done an actual video with me speaking. Um, if I've put a video up lately, it's one I where you can just see my hands making things or pictures that I've made into a video with the steps and some music. So I'm hopefully going to try get back into making some more videos for you. Um, that's the plan anyway. So today I want to share with you um, I've bouquet I'm in the process of making so I've already made um, some felt sunflowers and I've also got some felt balls that I've glued onto the wire so I just want to finish it off with some greenery or foliage so what I was going to share with you today is how put those to one side how I've made this a bit of foliage to go into the bouquet to give it a bit of dimension so I already have these leaves here that have been die cut in autumn colours and I had them on um, a bit of a longer wire so what I did was I just trimmed it down a bit for this these were used to make an autumn wreath and I had a load left over so rather than waste them um, or just dice cut new leaves I thought I'd find a way of fastening them onto the wire so I could use them so I've got my autumn coloured leads and I've got uh, a piece of 18 gauge wire that's a little bit stronger um, these are on the these are leaves are on 20 so they're a bit more bendy yeah, but I wanted to do something a little bit stronger and no glue today so no bending of fingers I've just got some florist tape so um, what you need to remember with the florist tape because I'll forget to tell you while I'm doing my video otherwise is and I've lost the end of it now, is when you are it, uh, when you are using this, you might think when you get it, oh, it's not sticky. But what you need to do when you're using it is if you stretch it while you're working with it, it then becomes sticky. So we'll start off. Let's cut that clean. So I'm going to take uh, one of my leaves. And I'm just going to hold it onto the top like that. And then I'm getting my florist tape. And I just start wrapping it. So it's just a case of twirling around your wire, pulling on the tape and fastening as you go. So every so often I'm just going to add some of the leaves into the mix so as you can see I'm just fastening uh, putting leaves in at intervals while I'm carrying on twisting my florist wire obviously you need to make sure they're spaced out you don't want them all in one direction and let's have one of those and you just keep twisting and adding where you think you might want the leaf to go At the moment, they look a bit bunched together, but it's when we fastened them on, them all up on the wire, then we can start manoeuvring them about. The yellow one. Be careful when you're stretching the wire, sorry, not the wire, the tape, that you don't pull too hard because then you'll rip it because it is um, just paper. There we go. So I've got my last leaf added in. So I just want to then go down to about here so that I'm covering all these bits of wire. And once this is in the bouquet, you won't, you won't see it all because it'll be mixed in with the flowers. So 
just keep going down until you've got past past where these are. Sure it's all secure so then you're left with looking like this so all I did then was because these are on wire I can pull them out like that so they look more like um, branch type foliage Yeah, so they're like that. You could um you could glue the these straight onto the stick, but then you're a little bit more limited of them coming out. So there we go. So that's a quick video on how I did those. So I've got four of those now. And then I just need to start putting my bouquet together. So what I'm doing to start with, I just put uh, one of the sunflowers by it and I've added all of my um, foliage. And I'm, oops, I need to poke myself in the eye then. And I'm just going to start adding the sunflowers around. Spin that one. The 18 gauge wire is very good. It um, it withholds the weight of the felt flowers, um, but it's also light enough that you can still bend it and maneuver it about. So that's those there, and I've just got a selection of uh, I've got orange and yellow felt balls. So then I can just add those at intervals where I might want them put them in oops. put them in there just gives an added um little bit of interest adding the felt balls sorry the video is a little bit close to the bouquet i'll add a picture as the thumbnail so just take it out to the shop for a moment I just want to add one right into the centre. So there we go, there's a, a rough idea of the bouquet. I'll add a, my thumbnail, the picture. Sorry, I can't get my words out today. I'll add the picture of the bouquet, finished bouquet as the thumbnail and then you can see the finished article. So. Thank you for joining me today and I'll see you again soon. Bye.